Merry Christmas to every one of you. Aloha audio surfers, I'm Mauro from Solarbox Studio here in the UK and today I'm very happy to announce that after a long period of silence we are back. Today in our gear review section we're gonna share with you an interesting piece of gear that I know you're gonna find very useful. Today we're going to share with you the unboxing of the SRI2 by Fluid Audio. Let's go! I'm starting to open the box to show you what is inside. Let's check it out. Backed by the people of Music Store UK. Here we go. Nothing else inside the box, as you can see. Okay, here is the box of the Fluid Audio SRI2 interface. Very nice the presentation of the box, very graphic and you can see the interface print on the box, that's cool. Let's open the box, there we go. Ok, let me show you what is inside. Ok, very well protect with all this anti-shock material that they put inside the box. This is a Cubase LE copy with the license and the download information. It is a light version of Cubase DAW. This is one USB standard cable and now let's see the interface itself. Ok, here we go. Very nice, I have to say that it feels in the hand like you get a product built like a tank with very quality materials. Here you get the big knob that control the main out level. There is four knobs in the top of the interface. I tried the knobs and they feel very smooth and they are quality built. Here in the front panel you can see that the interface has two combo jack XLR cable for instruments and microphones. The headphone jack in. You get the knob to control the headphone volume to adjust the level to your taste. Here is the speaker AB switch that allows you to monitor or hear two different pair of speakers. This is the line instrument switch. You get the gain knob gain meter. And here you can see 
the dot of the left is the minimum level and the dot on the right is the maximum level of volume of the interface. Here you get the knob that controls the amount of signal that enter from the DAW or from the channel that you are using to recording. Here you get the switch to activate the 48 volts, phantom, power or microphones. Also the bottom of zoom to zoom the board of the channel of the interface in only one stereo. In the left side you have the gain meter and the gain from the channel 1. In the back of the interface you can see two balanced pairs of outputs for two different pairs of speakers with jack connection. the USB computer connector, one slot for external power supply. And also one security key slot. As you can see, the quality of the construction is very impressive. It's a high quality product what you get for the money. Here in the studio, I used to work with one Apollo Twin and my Lynx Hilo converter and interface. As you can see, size-wise, the Fluid Audio is slightly bit bigger than the Apollo and also bigger than the Lynx, but look very nice, very sleek and very elegant. Overall, it's a very good product. I think this is perfect for some writers and for DJs. The USB cable is one standard USB A that you can see in many MIDI controllers devices and computer in general. To me the main feature of the interface is the monitor controller, one external monitor controller to handle two pairs of speakers cost itself 250 to 300 bucks. Here you get to balance output for that, which is great. Overall, it's a interface that I think is very useful for singers, songwriters that want to record it with quality in home and for who else? Well, also for DJs and for people that need a high quality interface for a low cost. I prove it this moment to tell you that if you want to support us and you like what we do, you can enter in our website in the shop section and there you get amazing merchandising about our studio. The services that we provide, our blog section with a lot of interesting links of gear manufacturers and other studios and also find very interesting articles about audio topics. Well, this was our review about the SRI2 by Fluid Audio. I hope you all of you get a merry merry Christmas, happy new year and aloha audio surfers, we see you on the next time. Thank you for watching, remember to subscribe and share.